good morning students myself mahima said today we will study another topic in java that is mathematical library methods mathematical library methods can also be called as mathematical library functions now java dot lang that is java dot language package contain classes fundamental to the design of java language it contains various functions various mathematical related functions which can be used to solve simple mathematical calculations the syntax of using this function is math dot function name and function sign semicolon now the first function which we will study is math dot sqrt this you have studied in class 9th also math dot sqrt it means it will return the square root of the type of value that is given here double a is equal to 16.0 is given double result is equal to math dot sqrt in bracket a so the value of a is 16 so the result which will be produced after computation would be 4 because the square root of 16 is 4 Now the second function is math dot cbrt. Cbrt means cube root. So this function will gives you the cube root of the given value. It will always give you the value in double, and it will be with the same sign. The sign will not change. For example, double x is equal to one twenty five. Double y is equal to minus one twenty five. So result one is equal to math dot cbrt x. Result two is equal to math dot cbrt y. So the output which will be generated, result one will give you the output five because the cube root of one twenty five is five, and result two will give you the answer minus five point zero because the cube root of minus one twenty five is minus five. Now the third function is math dot p o w p o w means power. This function computes a to the power of b. That is a to the power of b. Here we are taking an example. I n t a is equal to four, b is equal to two. Result is equal to math dot power a comma b. A is four, b is two. 4 to the power 2 is equal to 16 so the output would be 16 now the fourth function is math dot abs abs means absolute so it will give you the absolute value here we are taking an example float result 1 is equal to math dot abs in bracket minus 5.3 another float Result two is equal to math dot abs in bracket five point three. So the result which would be generated is result one is equal to minus five point two three with the same sign. It will give you the absolute value, and result two would be five point three only. Now, fifth function is math dot min that is min. it returns the minimum of two values that is uh, for example int result is equal to math dot min in bracket 10 comma 7 so what it will do it will give you the minimum of both of these values so out of these two values the minimum is 7 so the result is equal to 7 next is math dot max this is the opposite of min max means it will give you the maximum value that is the greater value so same int result is equal to math dot max 10 comma 7 so the output would be 10 now the seventh is math dot seal function now the seal function will give you the nearest value nearest number which is greater than or equal equal to to the value 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल फ्लोट रिजल्ट वन इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट सील फाइव पॉइंट थ्री फ्लोट रिजल्ट टू इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट सील फाइव पॉइंट फाइव फ्लोट रिजल्ट थ्री इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट सील फाइव पॉइंट जीरो रिजल्ट फोर इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट सील माइनस फाइव पॉइंट थ्री रिजल्ट फाइव इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट सील माइनस फाइव पॉइंट जीरो कि हेयर वी आर टेकिंग डिफरेंट वैल्यूज सो रिजल्ट वन विल बी जेनरेटेड फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट वन दैट इज फाइव पॉइंट थ्री सो इट विल गिव यू द नियरेस्ट ग्रेटर वैल्यू सो द नियरेस्ट ग्रेटर वैल्यू विल बी सिक्स पॉइंट जीरो ना रिजल्ट टू फाइव पॉइंट फाइव अगेन द नियरेस्ट ग्रेटर वैल्यू वुड बी सिक्स पॉइंट जीरो ना द थर्ड रिजल्ट थ्री इज फाइव पॉइंट जीरो सो इट विल रिमेन सेम दैट इज फाइव पॉइंट जीरो नाउ रिजल्ट फोर माइनस फाइव पॉइंट थ्री नाउ हेयर वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द माइनस नंबर सो इट विल गिव यू द नियरेस्ट ग्रेटर वैल्यू दैट वुड बी माइनस फाइव पॉइंट जीरो एंड अगेन वी आर टेकिंग अनदर नंबर माइनस फाइव पॉइंट जीरो सो द रिजल्ट विल बी माइनस फाइव पॉइंट जीरो ओनली नो द नेक्स्ट फंक्शन इज मैथ डॉट फ्लोर इट रिटर्न द नियरेस्ट होल नंबर दैट इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू द वैल्यू सो वी आर टेकिंग एग्जाम्पल फ्लोट रिजल्ट वन इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट फ्लोर फाइव पॉइंट थ्री फाइव पॉइंट थ्री नियरेस्ट लेस वैल्यू सो द रिजल्ट वुड बी फाइव पॉइंट जीरो सो सी द रिजल्ट इट इज फाइव पॉइंट जीरो नाउ वी आर टेकिंग अनादर रिजल्ट टू इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट फ्लोर फाइव पॉइंट फाइव अगेन रिजल्ट थ्री इज इक्वल टू रिजल्ट थ्री इज इक्वल टू फाइव पॉइंट जीरो अगेन रिजल्ट फोर इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट फ्लोर माइनस फाइव पॉइंट थ्री रिजल्ट फाइव इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट फ्लोर माइनस फाइव पॉइंट जीरो नाउ वील सी द आउटपुट आउटपुट ऑफ रिजल्ट वन इज फाइव पॉइंट जीरो आउटपुट ऑफ रिजल्ट टू इज फाइव पॉइंट जीरो आउटपुट ऑफ रिजल्ट थ्री इज फाइव पॉइंट जीरो नाउ आउटपुट ऑफ रिजल्ट फोर इज माइनस सिक्स बिकॉज हेयर वी हैव टेकन माइनस फाइव पॉइंट थ्री एंड इट विल गिव यू द नियरेस्ट लेसर वैल्यू एज इट इज अ नेगेटिव टर्म्स सो इट विल बी माइनस सिक्स ओके सो सिमिलरली माइनस फाइव पॉइंट जीरो सो द नियरेस्ट लेसर वैल्यू विल बी माइनस फाइव नाउ वी विल टेक अनादर फंक्शन मैथ डॉट आर आई एन टी रेंट इट विल गिव यू द ट्रंकेटेड वैल्यू ट्रंकेटेड राउंड ऑफ वैल्यू टू द नेक्स्ट एंटेजर डबल रिजल्ट वन इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट आर आई एन टी इन ब्रैकेट जीरो पॉइंट टू थ्री फाइव मैथ अगेन डबल रिजल्ट टू इज इक्वल टू मैथ डॉट आर आई एन टी इन ब्रैकेट वन पॉइंट नाइन थ्री फाइव नाउ हेयर यू कैन ईजिली सी दैट रिजल्ट वन Result one, we have taken zero point two three five. So the round of value will be zero point zero. In result two, we have taken one point nine three five. So the nearest round of would be two point zero. In result three, we have taken one point two three five. The nearest round of would be one point zero. Here in x we have taken one point nine, so the nearest round off would be two point zero. In y we have taken one point two five three, so the nearest round off would be one point zero. Now, math dot round function. Now the, it rounds a float and returns an integer value. Now what is the difference between this R I N T and that round? Here this R I N T will give you the same value. Um, the uh, means the same type of value, and here it will give you the value in integers only. So float x is equal to five point five nine. The result would be six because the nearest round off of five point five nine is 
six. Now, y is equal to five point one zero. The nearest round off of five point one zero is five. Now, next function is math dot exp. That is exponent. It will give you the value of e to the power of x. You must have studied exponentiation in maths, so this will give you the same value. Uh, the value of e is the base of the natural logarithm that is 2.71828 approximately. So, if we will take double result one is equal to math dot exp 1.0, so the result would be 2.71828 approx. Now. Next function math dot log, math dot log function will give you the natural logarithmic value of the specified double value. Here we are taking double result one is equal to math dot log one point zero. So the natural logarithmic value of one point zero is zero. Now this another function math dot copy sign. is a very interesting function this you have not studied earlier this function will copy the sign of one variable into the sign of into the into another number here we are taking two num uh, variables math dot copy sign variable 1 comma variable 2 a is equal to 7 b is equal to minus 3.4 we are writing the formula math dot copy sign a comma b so the resultant would be Now a will become minus seven, and b will remain same. It will remain minus three point four. Now, next is math dot random. It gives you a randomly selected number within the parameter specified. Here, int a is equal to in bracket int math dot random into six plus one. so what it will give it will generate any number from 1 to 6 here double b is equal to math dot random function sign here we have not written anything here uh, it is blank so it means uh, it is considered as a number which is less than 1 so it will generate any number from 0.0 to less than 1 now uh, Many more functions are there, like math dot log ten, which will give you the value with the base log ten. Now math dot sine, math dot cos, math dot tan. As you have studied sine, cos, tan, all the trigonometrical uh, values in maths, so it will give you the, it will generate the same values. Now here, few interesting uh, functions are also there. Math dot a cos. Math dot a sine, math dot a tan. So what this a means? A means inverse. So it will give you the inverse value of cos, inverse value of sine, inverse value of tan. So this is all, uh, all related to the topic, math function in Java. So student, I have given few uh, questions in the worksheet also. do do those questions in your fair copy and show me the result thank you